Welcome, level uppers, to another live reaction time. A little bit late on this one, but we're going to react to the newest trailer for Spider Man Into That's the Spider Verse. Because I haven't seen it yet. Mike, you have seen it, right. but I haven't seen it. Mm -hmm. I've heard amazing things about it. I think the first trailer was Bonkers Bananas, and I mean that in the best way possible. Bonkers Bananas. <laughs> bonkers Bananas. And I've seen images from this one, and it looks even more Bonkers Bananas, because there's things I didn't even know existed within this whole thing. Because I'm not totally up to date on the whole Spider-Verse thing. I, I don't know who all these characters are, but I'm really excited to check out this trailer. Some of them, they, they're just like really going, they're stuff from fun fact i didn't realize this before um the dude nick from new girl is the voice of peter parker yes and i was so surprised when you said you didn't know that i didn't know that at all and now i can't not well, like I, you know it's, how it's you awesome. hear somebody that's yeah. like, it now penetrates yeah i mean i oh, i okay, recognize nick. it I, I didn't even need to be told that i think his voice is so recognizable in the role but i just think it's so funny anyway let's uh let's get ready here mike i'll give you a three two one all right all right, on one this time. On go this time, as on it always has been time. forever. Okay. All right, ready? Yep. Three, two, one, go. My name is Peter Parker. I'm pretty sure you know the rest. I saved the city, fell in love, then I saved love the, the city. music. And yeah, man. And again. Look, I'm a comic book, a serial, I get a Christmas <laughs> album, and a so so popsicle. Oh, the best popsicle. I love it. Not anymore. Spider Man. Swings in once a day, zip zaps out his little ass and answers to no one. I love you, moms. Yeah, I know that. You gotta say I love you, Dad. Dad, are you serious? I, I wanna, wanna hear it. it. Look at this place. Dad, I love you. Dad, I love you. <laughs> I love that scene. It's gonna be great. That is the best. Dad, I love you. My name is Miles Morales. <laughs> one and only Spider Man. I love that. It's gonna suck when he dies. You ever hear the super collider? You're gonna love this. Dimension opening now. You're like me. That's impossible. <laughs> All right, kid. Listen up. This fry is your universe. It's soggy. It's weird. It's gross. <laughs> this delicious normal fry is my universe. So you want to learn to be Spider-Man? Can you teach me? Yes, I can. Time to swing. <laughs> Good. You're doing it. Double tap to release and whip it out again. Okay. Double tap and whip. That's awesome. Ah, oh, she looks awesome. Mm -hmm. I'm from another another dimension. How many more spider people are there? Hey fellas. Oh, Noir. I have no idea what the shit that is, but it looks awesome. Mm -hmm. It can get weirder. Okay. Is that a thing? We need to get back to our universes soon. Brooklyn is gonna collapse. My family <laughs> lives in Brooklyn. Whoa, 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 whoa. Miles, what's wrong? This was never your city. It's mine. Oh man. Holy shit, Scorpion looked awesome. Collider, none of us will have a home to go home to. Remember, what makes you different? Let's go. Is what makes you Spider-Man. Officer? I love you. Ah. <laughs> That's awesome. That way, that way. Other way, other way, other way, other way. Do animals talk in this dimension? Because I don't want to freak them out. The animation for... The animation is so cool. The animation so for cool. Noir is great. Like, they like, kept him with that, like, bubbly version of the... Uh, of like drawing like, yeah. i don't know i just i love that art jose monster says this might be my favorite spider-man movie and i have to say i agree i think this might beat homecoming for me absolutely i can just base off this trailer all alone this is like the animation style is so freaking cool man and uh i love the different designs they've went with with scorpion and green goblin being this huge monster noir spider-man and then just introducing all these things i didn't even know existed within the spider-verse it just looks so exciting exciting yeah, Pork, uh, what was it? Peter Porker? As people are calling him in the chat, yeah. I think I saw. That is just so exciting and different and interesting. Uh, I, I was wondering about Mary Jean. We didn't get an actual like, like a conversation with her in the trailer. I wonder how involved she will be. He looks at her picture multiple times as if he can't talk to her or, or as if they're maybe separated i don't know what's going to go on there uh, and i wonder how they're going to balance that too are we going to have mm -hmm. a storyline that gets us really connected to our traditional peter parker or is mm -hmm. it really going to be a miles morales story you know yeah i think um i think this is going to be his oh, I, I lost you there I, say no, that again i'm just saying 
I was saying, I think this is going to be his own thing. I think this is going to be a good setup to why we need to care about Miles. I think this is a good way to introduce both of them and allow Miles to be really the star because mm-hmm. it's setting it up as, hey, listen, I'm Peter Parker. I had my stint. I saved the city. You know, I got the girl. I did all this stuff, and this is why I'm awesome. This is why you love me. Oh, look, now I intertwine. Oh, look, this is how we explain the Spider-Verse now. Oh, look, this is why you're watching Miles Morales all the time, and now I have to go back to my universe, but this is Miles Morales' thing, and we still have Spider-Man, you know, Peter Parker, Spider-Man on the side, while Miles Morales will have this cartoony, beautiful, best version of Spider-Man that we could ever imagine. Yeah. I also I have to say and it's a weird like a comparison to make, but for some reason it's giving me like Scott Pilgrim versus the world vibes. Do you get that at all? The attitude? Yeah, like the attitude, the humor, even I the part where that. like Gwen Stacy is playing the drums. Like, I don't know. Mm-hmm. It just it, it gave me Scott Pilgrim vibes, which is the best thing because mm-hmm. Scott Pilgrim is one of my favorite movies in all honesty. I think that movie is so great. I just watched it again on Netflix. Um, so any it. any comparisons to Scott Pilgrim is, is a great thing. Uh, I'm so excited for this. It's uh, it, it could turn out to be uh, my favorite comic book movie in a long time. Yeah. I, think. I, I really I do think can that. I 100% agree with that. Uh, is this Tobey Maguire's version of Spider-Man? I do wonder if they will give us some like kind of funny little Easter eggs like that. They did. Did you see at the beginning of the movie where he was saying I think the word city and every single thing that Peter Parker was talking about was a thing from like Toby stopping Maguire. the train. Yeah, like stopping the train. Yeah, so he stopped the train. Well, he did. He said I you know save the city, stopping the train. I got the girl, kissed her upside down. I saved the city again with the car that went into the window of the restaurant in two with Doc Ock. Um, and then all the other scenes with Sandman and Doc. I wonder if that'll stuff. be more than an Easter egg. They're like, I wonder, like, is that this specific? Is this Tobey Maguire being played by the guy from New Girl? Like, is that what we're saying then? That this is that I Peter know, Parker? Yeah. Okay, yeah, that's I what we're saying. Because, like, for instance, it. in Spider-Man: The Game on PS4, he also talks as a little Easter egg about stopping a train at that. That's one part. that's different because that's just one thing, and that's just like. This was a bunch of those types of things they said all in succession, which basically says, "Hey, this is how we're connecting that." Right. Uh, I know there was a five minute clip after Venom. I don't really want to watch that though. I don't want to see like a five, five minute, minute clip, clip from the movie of this movie. Yeah. Why would they do that? I guess to hype up Spider Man uh, into the Spider Verse, but and That's to do the whole after the credits thing. <laughs> I'll guarantee yeah. you that five minutes, not knowing what it connects to or anything else about that movie, was better than than Venom. <laughs> Maybe. I, I mean, there's a lot of people saying they liked Venom, so I don't want to speak Yeah, there's a lot of people that said they liked Suicide Squad. How'd that, that go? Is, I will agree with you there, and I don't understand anyone that said that. But anyway, this looks freaking amazing, and we're curious what you guys think. Let us know in the comments below what you thought of the trailer and what you thought of our so reaction. If you liked it, hit that like button. If you disliked our reaction, you can hit that dislike button. But more don't than anything, do don't do that. Hit that subscribe button if you want to catch our future uploads. Definitely hit that bell. That's the most important thing if you want to catch our future uploads. We do a lot of reactions. And uh, if you want to see this live, you can see that we are doing it live with the comments on the on the corner there. Go to twitch.tv slash the level up show. Give us that follow, turn on notifications, and hopefully you can catch us next time. Uh, and we hope you do. Until then, take care. And as always, don't forget to level up. Level up.